Hey guys, in this video we are going to be taking a look at the devastated Tehran build for the Fenrir. So I thought I'd cover a build like this for players in the lower leagues like myself because I think this is a really effective brawling build at close range. Oh, it looks so good as well. But yeah, before we do that, um, I am going to be doing a chest opening. Only two spins, but oh yeah, they've changed this as well. They've changed this. You can now get uh, the sonic weapons. Oh, and all these pilots too. That's pretty good. I wonder if they've changed the middle one. Oh, there's that Alquin. I really want that. No, this all looks pretty similar. I don't think they've changed that. No, that's all the same. Well, anyway, I'm going to do these two spins. Hopefully we can get some gold or something. Pilot skills are what I use gold for. Oh no, a silver booster. I barely ever use those. Oh, that's pretty much useless to me. Please get gold. Oh no, silver. Oh, that's so bad. Only 100,000. Oh, that's really bad. Oh well. The only reason I'm doing this middle chest is because I really want the Alquin. Because I just really like this bot. Anyway, I, oh yeah, I am upgrading the Loki at the moment. So hopefully that's going to be a bit stronger. I've put jump unit on this because it's hopefully it'll do better with that. So let's jump into a game with this Fenrir build. Okay, so I have dropped in on castle map with this Fenrir. Hopefully we can get some kills here. I might just take this thing straight to the bridge and just see if we can get some kills with it. I have so many pilot skills on this as well. I have Roadhog and stuff, so this is a really fast Fenrir. I think this is going to do pretty well. Right, let's see if we can get this beacon. Oh wait, we already have it. Let's see if we can kill- Oh, there's another Fenrir. I'm going to see if I can kill him. I think he has the same build as me, actually. This is a pretty good build for the lower leagues. And it does look like other people are running this too. Yeah, that's definitely another devastated Tehran build. I should be able to kill this guy. My teammates are helping me weaken him. I might get this guy, actually. No, he died. I might as well go for this guy. I should get him. Yep, there we go. This build does a lot of damage, especially with the Devastator. Can I hit this guy? That might be another Fenrir or something. Oh, they're in our spawn. How did that happen? Oh, no, never mind. Right, what's behind this rock? Is that a Scorpion or something? Oh, that's a Natasha over there. Ooh. I think he has Zeus and Gecko or something. So, I might move back a bit here, just so my Tehrans can reload. Oh, this, has this guy got a death wish? We should be able to get this Ares too when his shield comes down. Yeah, he's going to die really quickly. Oh, we should be able to get him. Come on, reload. Yep, that guy got taken out. Oh, they have an Algin over there. We might be able to kill this guy. I might just take this thing straight into their spawn and see how much damage we can do. Oh no, this guy's hawking me. I might be able to kill him when he lands. I'm going to go for him. Oh, where did this guy come from? We'll oh, just deal with him quickly. Oh, oh no. Oh, put no. I thought I healed there. Did I not heal? Oh well, I'm going to drop in with the Loki next and see if I can get some beacons. I want to test out the jump unit on this as well. I still haven't managed to get a pilot for this yet, but I think it's just going to be a regular one that I'm going to hire until I get the legendary pilot for the Loki. I might just sneak over this bridge. Oh, but they're getting, they're getting the bridge though. I'm not sure. I might try and go for their home beacon or something. What is that guy doing? He's, he's kind of below. I think he's going to get killed. 
Yeah, we have one of their home beacons. I might go for their other one. Oh. Oh, this Al Quinn over here just didn't even see me. Right, so I am gonna get their home beacon now. Um, yeah, I'm gonna go for this guy. Do some damage to him. There, we have their home beacon. <laughs> he just noticed. He's gonna die. Oh. We're almost five capping them. No, they're getting our home beacon. Uh oh, I gotta stay away from that guy. He's gonna stove me. Oh, there's so many titans on the bridge. <laughs> I might just go for this beacon anyway. They're all moving. Oh no, this Arthur is seeing me though. Please. Oh, I knew he was gonna try and knock me off. <laughs> oh. That was a narrow escape. Oh, we have a titan over here. I'm not really sure, because that Arthur is just gonna knock me off the bridge if I go that way. Oh, the epic 1v1 between the kids. Who will win? Hopefully our guy. <laughs> Please. Please. Oh, no, I think our guy's gonna die. I'm just gonna help out. <laughs> he doesn't even care. He hasn't got time for a Loki. <laughs> I think we're gonna kill him. This stove is doing so much damage, though. I really need to get mechanic on this. Yeah, we managed to take him out, that was good. All the titans seem to have left the bridge, so I might go and get this beacon. They do- they almost have three beacons. What's this guy down here in? Is that a leech or something? No, what is that? Oh, it's a Raijin! Did how I thought that was a leech. Ooh. Oh, I'm so tempted to go for this guy. But he, he, he's just going to put his shield up. Well, I managed to get this beacon. I might just sneak up behind him and get him. <laughs> oh, and how much damage? Oh, no, he noticed. I think he's getting leeched onto. Yeah, he is. Now, he won't have time to put his shield up. And then if I move out the way as well. Oh, we did decent damage to him. But he did some damage to me. I might try and sneak around behind him again. This Nodens up here is going for him too. I wonder if I can just sneak one of my weapons and then just hit him. He's got his shield. Oh, this Nodens is healing me. Yes. That's really helpful when I did have a mechanic on this. Oh, he's just going to turn and face me now because he knows. Kill him. Oh, someone else got it. This game's gonna be over soon. Oh, we have a Jaeger. Their beacon bars are almost down. Yeah, there we go. That was actually a really good game with that Fenrir. Okay, so here are the results for that game. Here are the honor points. We did pretty well with that Fenrir. I think we got a couple kills, so that was pretty good. We got last place on the team, though. It's probably because I was in the Loki for most of the game. Let's do another game. Okay, so I have dropped in with the Loki on Power Plant map. I think I'm going to use this to secure some beacons before I drop in with this Fenrir. I'm going to go for this beacon. Have they changed the water? Is it just me or does this look different? Right, let's see if we can get this beacon. Oh, there's an Ares or something over there. What is that? Right, so we got this beacon. I might go for this guy. I think he's a Hades. Yeah, he is. This water looks different. Right, I might go for this beacon. Oh no, that was a bad idea, because this other guy's just gonna get that beacon now. That guy might be able to kill him. If I get this beacon, it might stop me. Oh no, can this guy- Oh, the leech is gonna hit me. Oh no, I've messed up here. Oh, they're getting all the beacons. No, I should have stayed on that other beacon. What is this guy doing? <laughs> He's just waiting. No, he's gonna try and kill me. No, I need to get out of here. We need to get a beacon. Oh no, I'm doing so badly. Oh no, this guy, this blitz is gonna die. Wait, is that a Cerberus? It's a Stella Cerberus. I think I'm gonna go for this guy. Yeah, he's, yeah, he's, yeah that was bad timing. That was very bad timing. 
right. I don't know where to. I might spawn here. Let's see if the Fenrir can salvage things. <laughs> We're really not doing that well. Let's see if we can wait for this loot and then just try and kill him. Come on! Oh, that guy got the kill. We need to get some beacons here. Maybe I can get these beacons. I also have mechanic on this Fenrir and that really helps. Okay, so we've got this beacon. I might go for that one down there. Another reason why I like the Fenrir is because it can brawl with titans. <laughs> it's that strong. I have actually beaten a titan with relatively low health in this thing before. Right, so hopefully no one spawns in here. Yep, there we go. Oh, look how low that guy is. There, we've got that beacon. What is that guy in? Oh, it's a falcon. Let's see how this Fenrir does against him. Yeah, we do decent damage. Look at that. We should be able to kill him. Oh, he locked me. Come on. Reload. Fire. Kill him. He lost the weapon. Yes, we got that falcon. Let's see what else they have over here. I'm not sure what that guy's in. I need to reload. So this mechanic is healing me up while they figure out what's- Oh, it's a scorpion! Come on! Oh, he's gonna go for the beacon. I need to kill this guy. He froze me. Oh, why, why would you blink that? He could have got that beacon if he stayed. He's gonna be teleporting again soon. I might be able to kill him. What's this guy in? Is that another leech? He's gonna use his ability. I need to back up. Oh no, he might not kill him. <laughs> oh, we got him. Oh no, is that the scorpion? He just ran bars me. The leech was bait. No, we're gonna lose this beacon. The speed of this. Oh, he teleported. Come on, I have to kill this guy. If I move backwards as well. It's going to be hard though. I might die. Yeah, because he's just going to uh, blink back there. I might be able to kill him. Come on. Heal. Yes, we got him. Triple kill. Oh, that Logie decided to stop. <laughs> I can still hit him here with this Devastator. Oh, there we go. Oh, no. There's a notion back there. No. I'm going to die. No. No, I might be, I just do as much damage. I lost the Devastator, no. This Loki just came to finish me off. That actually lasted a decent amount of time. We did really well with that. I'm gonna drop him with my Nodens now and see if we can help out. Oh no, that's the game. <laughs> okay, so here are the results for that game. Here are the honor points. We did pretty well with that game. That Fenry got quite a few kills. We got second on the team. So yeah, a good game. Okay, so I hope you enjoyed that gameplay of that Fenrir build. I think it's a very effective brawler in lower leagues. The Devastator definitely helps out because it does mean that enemies can't heal up either from your damage that you do with that sonic weapon. If you did enjoy this video, please like and subscribe and I will see you in the next one.